Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog. It's me, Andrea, and I can barely see y'all. I'm literally just looking towards the direction of the camera because my eyes are so dilated. I have to get super far away just so I can see anything right now, but I just got approved for eye surgery, guys. I just got approved for eye surgery and my appointment is going to be on the 20th of, um, it's gonna be on the 20th of, the 20th yeah the 20th of december and y'all when i say i was just shook like i just expected because i tried this twice before like i tried this for two years in a row i kept going back trying to get the surgery and it just wasn't working and they never really gave me a reason um before why i couldn't get the surgery um oof, i can't even it's not far enough away i can't see that i'm gonna have to wait i'm on my phone right now because i forgot my camera at home Actually, I didn't forget it. I didn't expect myself to be vlogging. God dang, <sighs> I hate this. Uh, I can see everything that's far away, of course. I just can't see anything like that's even this close to my face right now. Like this phone is too close to my face, so I can't see it. My lips are so dry. Anyway, so yeah, I tried for like two years in a row um, to get the surgery when I was at Fort Stewart. Hell, I even tried when I was in Texas. Y'all, it just was not working out. I just could not get approved for this surgery. And they wouldn't, they couldn't even tell me why I wasn't approved for the surgery. But I go in today, not even that optimistic about the situation. I'm like, all right, we're gonna try it. We're, what's, what, 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 what's the, what's the harm I'm trying, right? So I go up, they do all the little tests and stuff like that. And it was a, it was a process guys. This was a process. I made this appointment months ago when I got to my, my, the unit that I'm with now, I have, you know, got the packet, filled everything out. My commander signed it. I turn it in. I get my appointment for today. I go up today and they just have to do all of these things, including like, I can't see, I can't even read my text messages right now. Um, yeah, so I had to do all this stuff. They gave me some eye drops to like numb my eyes to do certain little tests. They had to dilate my eyes. So my eyes are really dilated. And they said this is gonna last for like 24 hours. <laughs> I have a freaking assignment due tonight. <laughs> tonight that I'm not gonna be able to do because my freaking eyes are dilated, but I'm gonna try my hardest. I'm gonna try my best. So yeah, I go in, I'm sitting there and y'all, I'm anticipating, like I'm just playing with my fingers. I'm so nervous. And he comes in and he's looking at my maps and he's looking at all of my test results and stuff. And he goes, he goes, hmm, let me go and look at something. He's like, cause LASIK is definitely out of the picture, but let's see about PRK. And I'm like, all right, <sighs> he's about to tell me no again. I'm about to, um, I'm just gonna have glasses and contacts forever. And he comes back in and he's like, okay yeah Lasix definitely we're not going to do that but we can do PRK and I was just like what <laughs> I was like what did you really just give me the okay oh my goodness so he gave me all of this paperwork I have to take a pregnancy test so I'm gonna have to wait until my eyes focus because it says take a pregnancy test one business day before so I need to check the calendar just so I can see when I have to go in to get see that i have to go in to get this stuff done but it's like a pregnancy test um a list of things that i have to do before and the day of the surgery oh my gosh i'm gonna have to drop i'm gonna have to have a driver i forgot about that who can come and get me <laughs> who's gonna be able to drive me after my appointment i didn't even think about that i'll have somebody i'll have somebody do not wear earrings do not wear makeup false lashes do not wear lotion, I'm about to be ashy. Do not shave, do not wear aftershave, there we go. Um, please eat prior to arriving at surgery, cool. I'm gonna eat some hash browns like usual. And if you're sick, okay. So yeah, it's pretty straightforward, y'all. I cannot believe, I cannot believe I got approved 
for this freaking surgery because I really been wanting this surgery for so long. I would love to be able to see with my God-given eyes, you know, that thing that people can do and I have to pay for. So I'm super excited, but I feel like at this point, I'm just ranting. Um, it is 16, 16, 11. <laughs> It's 1611 and I'm going to wait around post because I do have a soldier coming in um, who I was supposed to be sponsoring. It's a really confusing situation because I'm sponsoring this soldier, um, but she was, I was made her sponsor when I was in my last unit. So I'm just not sure how things are going to work, but I don't want to leave her high and dry. I've been reaching out to somebody else to um, reach out to her and get in contact just so she can have somebody here. They haven't done it yet. So I'm like, all right, I'm just going to have to, you know. I'm gonna make sure she's taken care of. So yeah, I'm gonna wait around post a little bit. I'm about to, mm, I'm about to head to the company. Yeah, I'm about to go ahead and head to the company really quick. Just so, blah, blah, blah. Okay. let's see. Oh my God, I'm about to get sick. I want to know how to pay someone money for glasses and contacts. I'm so excited. I can't wait. what's up it's a little bit later and i just finished cleaning my room just a little actually a lot i had to clean my room a lot um i had to clean my bathroom the whole bathroom um this little area in there and this whole area over here i had to clean my room i had to wash my sheets i'm in the middle of doing laundry so ignore this little pile back here i'm still working on it okay i'm still working on it but when i say i let my room become a mess i let my room become a mess but i took a break um and i just changed my clothes i just put on a little workout outfit because i'm about to try to go to the gym for about an hour or so try to get some lifting in y'all y'all know that i be running all the time i just work out with my body weight all the time and i've started going to the gym to try to lift some weights because i just think i need to do that okay and yes i'm on my phone i left my freaking camera in the car so we are rocking with the phone right now but um let me tell y'all the stupid thing i did like two days ago so i went to the gym two days ago because i wanted to see i think it was about two days ago because i wanted to see where i was at with my deadlift or whatever so i get there and i pick up the hex bar and i'm like all right i need to see where i'm at with this deadlift put the hex bar on the floor i go over and i ask the lady that was working there i'm like hey how much does this bar weigh because you know i'm trying to get to 140 pounds i'm like how much does this bar weigh and she said 25 pounds now i should have known that bar felt way heavier than 25 pounds like in my mind I knew that but I don't know why listen I slapped all this freaking weight on there trying to get to 140 pounds and when I'm over there I'm literally pull like I'm just pulling I'm pulling this freaking weight and I'm like I cannot lift this I was able to lift it twice in a row like I would, I would be able to bring it up once put it down bring it up twice bring it down but then after that I'm like dang I'll have to take a quick break and do it again I can bring it up once put it down bring it up once pull it down I could not get the three and I'm like there's no way I'm this week there's no way I got this week I haven't been out of the gym that long 
finally ask somebody for help. I'm like, hey, can you lift this so I can watch your form? Because I'm not understanding how to do this. And he's like, you might want to take some weight off. And I'm like, this is 140 pounds. I should be able to lift 140 pounds. And he's like, that's like 170, 75 pounds. And I'm like, is that what my back hurt? <laughs> Y'all, when I say my freaking back was so tight, like it's still... It's still a little tight. Like when I bend over, I definitely need to stretch. I need to roll it out or something. But I was like, is this one my back? Is that one my back hurt so bad? And I ended up taking off the weight. I was able to get to the 140 and I was able to lift it. Okay, but I feel like I would have did better if my back wasn't hurting. So I had to recover for a few days. Now I'm about to get back at it. And I'm about to be smarter about what I'm lifting from now on because when I say that could have been so bad, like I, it could have been bad. Like I don't feel like I like, tore anything or anything's like you know fractured or anything like that but it was definitely stiff so let's not make that mistake again but yeah i'm about to go ahead and um hurry up go to the gym i gotta stop at the store to get some freaking kitty litter and try to come back and go to sleep because um i decided to pick up a second job and my background check and all that good stuff finally came back and I'm strongly considering picking up a shift for tomorrow. Even though it's my weekend, I like just got off of like a bunch of 12 hours in a row. It's my weekend, but honestly, I need to make more money because one, I want to finish decorating my house. Two, I'm honestly trying to get a new car. And three, I just need to get my savings account back where it was at. So I'm thinking I'm gonna just suck it up. Um, get up really early in the morning, drive out there because it's like an hour and 30 minutes away from me. Um, just to see how I like it, to see if it's something that, you know, is something I want to continue to do repeatedly and see how much money I can make. So, yeah, that's enough rambling for now. I'm going to go ahead and let Angel know that I'm ready to go. Let me not forget my water bottle because last time I forgot my water bottle, I was pissed. Get my headphones and be done. Y'all, I'm mad. Somebody took the freaking shift that I wanted to take tomorrow, but it's fine because I just took a 12 hour for, um saturday which is fine i'm sitting there looking at my schedule like do i really want to do that is that too much work for me but no i think that's fine because that's going to be an easy 500 for working one day so let's get it <laughs> anyway so let me go ahead and take my ass to this gym and to be completely honest Hold on, because now I'm wondering if the gym is even open today. Let me, let me call somebody and see if they know, because I don't even know. What the hell? I don't even know if the gym is open, y'all. I didn't even think about that. I did not even think about that. This is why I need to get my own equipment. This right here is why I need to get my own equipment and just put it in my garage because it's bad enough I have issues being able to go to the gym with my availability and the kids and everything else and now you mean to tell me when I have some free time it's not open whatever so the gyms are closed unfortunately but it's fine I'm up here on the track and I'm thinking I'm gonna just try to do some stair workouts um it's a few people up here, but it's not that bad. I'm about to go ahead and head over to these stairs. Do this for probably a good 30 minutes to an hour, depending on how I'm feeling, and then go back home. Well, go to the store and then go back home. So, yeah, let's get it. Baby, don't 
don't check for me Taking time out to be And live my life off screen Taking time out to be And live my life hey. Taking just don't do And live my life Don't take it personal just building, it's my season, lay foundation, make a name for generations, please and make a, and take a break or a little vacation and chasing blues away, hey, hey. you always posting a pictures, trying to look like you winning, or look like you always be working, soaking the moments you live in, yeah, you got the nerve to be on me, faking your life for the IG. You got my number, don't ask me Cause baby, I'm on hiatus I'm on hiatus I'm on hiatus mm -hmm. I'm on hiatus uh -oh. Baby, don't check for me So I finished on a track a little bit ago. Hopefully you can hear me. It was raining just a little bit, but I finished on the track a little bit ago and I feel so good. I don't even know why. Every time I'm done working out, whether or not it's on the track, whether or not it's in the gym, I always end up feeling super good afterwards. But what I'm about to do now, I'm about to, I'm looking for Buffalo Wild Wings. I'm about to go to Buffalo Wild Wings and see if I can get these 10 free wings they was handing out. When I say y'all, y'all soldiers don't play on Veterans Day, okay? It was packed earlier today it was a fail when i say i wanted to go out and get some food i went to well okay we tried to go to a few restaurants it just was not working hold on let me make sure i'm in the right place yeah it just was not working y'all do not play about veterans day i see and it's still looking super packed over here oh my goodness i guess i'm just not gonna get no food i'm gonna just pay for my food because i don't got time get some carry out but um yeah, I'm about to go ahead, try to get some food. Okay, I can't turn there. What? I don't even, hold on. Is it over here? Where is Buffalo Wild Wings, y'all? Hold on, let me turn around. But, what was I saying? I'm about to, <laughs> I don't know my way around. Anyway, anyway, anyway. I'm about to try to get some food real quick. Um, Take my ass home, get in a shower. I have, oh, let me not forget. I have to go to the store and get some freaking kitty litter. Let me not forget that. So I'm gonna go to the store, get some kitty litter. After I grab this food from wherever, um, I gotta go home, get in the shower, and then I'm gonna study a little bit. I don't have anything due. This is really dark. Hold on. There we go. I don't have anything due tonight, but hold on. Where is Buffalo Wild Wings? Here's Red Robin. Maybe it's over there. Let me go over there and check. But um, yeah, I don't have anything due tonight, but I do have two exams due tomorrow, my unit exams. So I wanna study tonight. That way I'm not like on my assignments for a really long time tomorrow. Yeah, and then honestly just relax for the rest of the night. Today was a good day. Hey guys, what's up? It's later, later. I'm just sitting here. I got out the shower and all that good stuff. I'm so tired, but I'm sitting here eating my food. I already started eating, but I'm eating my food. I'm watching TV. I'm literally just chilling, y'all. I got a candle over here lit, okay? 
it's a vibe it's a whole vibe right now so yeah i don't know how long this vlog is so far i don't want to make it too long so i'm gonna go ahead and um close it out here and i might start another vlog saturday maybe if you like this video make sure you like it comment if you have any questions comments whatever subscribe if you want to watch more videos and i'll see you guys in my next one bye i'm in a place serene and pure and free hey i ain't worried about